Ah, waku 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 eh. Hey, hey. Good morning. Leo, leo nataka tubonge story moja. Story ya nani? To focus na baba. Nimesikia kuna watu wanaongelelea baba vibaya. Siju ufalme huku chini hii Kenya umekushinda na waenda nyumbani utafute ufalme wa binguni. That's nonsense. Before, wachana na kwanza hiyo. Before, mimi ni kwa natukia baba sana sana sana. Juu ya nini? Eh? Community ni grow up from. Hiyo ndiyo kitu watu wanafaa kupigana nayo sana. Sasa hii unaweza una kwa kijiji ya huko Kiambu ama wapi huko Muranga. Uongelele baba, usikie mpaka watoto wanamchukia. Hawamjui. Lakini through venye wamefidiwa na wazazi, we kemodoge ke anga. Unasikia? Unachukia mtu bure. I grew up in uh, that uh, circumstance ya kuchukia baba bure. Nikakuja nikakuwa mkubwa nikaendelea kufuata unajua kuna kitu mtoto ukilea mtoto mtoto wa asomangi venye unamwambia eh venye anasikia mtoto masikio yake ni macho venye anaona wewe ukifanya ndio wanafanya na ndio unasikia anga ukilea mtoto wako ati wewe unafanya tabia mbaya lakini wewe unampeleka kanisa atafuata hiyo maneno ya kanisa atawe ndio role model wake atakufuata na ndio unasikia wazazi badilisheni tabia eh mbadilishe tabia ni watoto wenu wakikua wa grow up wa wakifuata njia zenu juu huyo mtoto wewe ndio role model wake anyway mimi sasa kusema baba yangu alikuwa anachukia baba ama nini lakini you know where i came from nimetoka ina kikuyu community so the whole community ilikuwa inasema eh hey, unaona na juu ya siasa Kenya siasa Kenya ni mbaya inaweza kutuma uchukie mtu bure eh? kuna watu wanachukia baba they don't know the history venye baba amesaidia Kenya eh hawajui baba ni nani who is baba wakati wa moi eh? baba baba ndio alipigana na moi mpaka ikakuwa ika, ika sasa pres, tupate president mwingine otherwise moi angeturudi mpaka mwisho hmm? waku baba ni mtu wa maana for me baba is a hero kwangu is a hero na saa hii ako kwa situation mbaya sana na muombea na muombea Mungu sana baba asikie poa asikie poa sana saa hii eh tumuombee baba apone na Mungu ampe maisha marefu hii dunia aishi sana juu hata all development zimefanyika Kenya ni juu ya opposition eh ni juu ya opposition nini kupea government pressure kuuliza maswali kwa nini amjafanya hii mri promise hii amjafanya that the work of opposition opposition ina pressure government government ina ina fulfill uh, the word zenye iliambia watu wakati wa uchaguzi sasa hii tumepromisiwa vitu mingi sana vitu zingine hazina hii happen lakini juu ya opposition huyo baba mnadharau hapo baba ni mtu wa maana sana Kenya mtu anafaa heshimiwe sana sana na watu juu baba ndio ameshikilia hiyo nafasi ya ku pressure government ndio government ifanye kazi eh hiyo ndio kazi of opposition watu wenye wajui watu wenye wanaongelelea vibaya sana baba wewe ufikirie sana who is baba isipokuwa ni baba Kenya ingekuwa mahali imefika eh baba ame pressure government government ya kibaki akai pressure akakuja akapata nafasi pia akafanya mambo na kibaki unaona and that's why kibaki saa hii huwa anasifiwa hakuna president alifanya development kama kibaki juu ya nini juu ya baba baba used to pressure everything pressure anapaya watu pressure lazima wangefanya although kibaki was a good man kibaki alikuwa ni watu economist unajua watu economist ni mtu mnaweza aenda na yeye kwa hoteli mkunywe chai yeye yeah, itishe bili yake <laughs> na ulipe yako eh yeah? mtu hataki kucheza na pesa unaona na ndio baba utasikia baba akipeana pesa huku huku baba ni economist baba anajua pesa ina muhimu umuhimu sana hmm? a patriot mtu anapenda nchi yake anapigania since 1992 eh yeah? mpaka saa hii apumziki ndio nchi isimame 
Alafu unasikia mtu mwingine akitusi baba sijui nini umeraaniwa we we hujaraaniwa what have you done in your life eh we mtu umebarikiwa shido pepo ibilisi eh nisikie upuzi kama hiyo ati baba alilaaniwa sijui na baba yake we umebarikiwa na baba yako uko na kiti gani in life what are you doing in life eh umepita baba juu ribarikiwa nonsense eh tufikirie tukiongea at least for me baba is a hero ni shujaa kwangu baba ni shujaa shujaa mkubwa sana hmm? hey baba ni mwanaume wa wanaume unaona mbele ya wanaume kwa nini ingekuwa ni mimi hata juzi ndio nilikuwa nafikiria ingekuwa ni mimi nisimame mara ya kwanza nianguke mara ya pili nianguke ya tatu siwezi simama <laughs> I give up. <laughs> Ningekuwa nisha give up, but Baba Maratano is a very strong man. And a bado yuko, very strong. That's a strong man. Mtu a give up. Wana umewachacha sana hii dunia wanaweza simama ati mara mbili, tatu, nne unaanguka you fail. Kuna mtu ana fail once in a business na anachukia hiyo biashara kabisa in lifetime. Eh? Na ni mwanaume. Baba ni mwanaume wa nguvu sana a strong man a hero eh mtu anafaa hata apewe siku yake tunamsherehekea in, in the world nilikuwa nasoma i think hata hakuna opposition ashawe isimama mara kama tano akianguka akianguka akiibiwa unaona na bado ameshikilia that's a very strong man tunafaa hata tupewe siku moja ya kusherehekea baba Hmm? kama ni mimi nilikuwa naulizwa unaona baba ni mtu wa maana sana na Mungu ammbariki sana na muongezee siku za kuishi hii dunia unaona waku so watu wenye wanaongelelea baba negative ingia ingia nini youtube enda usome kuhusu baba who is raila or amor odinga na alianza wapi politics zake kwa ni mtu amepigana kupigana ameshikwa amefungwa juu ya wa Kenya a patriot mtu anapigania Kenya mtu anapenda nchi yake eh anashikwa anashikwa anafungwa anatoka bado ana, ana, anafanya kuna watu wanafungwa kuna mtu anashikwa na sanitizer na pesa kidogo ananyamaza lifetime baba hawezi a very strong man ingekuwa ni kunyamazishwa na pesa baba angenyamazishwa kitambo lakini alikataa alikata hiyo maneno ataki ye corrupt ataki corruption ataki kupewa kitu wa nyamaze na ndio unapata watu wanasema baba ataki kutoa juu ataki corruption the genuine man eh lakini in the, the world we have the genuine people eh they suffer a lot juu <laughs> watu nao wanataka mtu na wasanitize na waambie uongo anawafanya nini Eh? but for me saa hii mimi sizemi ati um, i still support baba at your president it's not president hiyo iliisha and we have to accept the reality na tumheshimu baba saidi yake baba ako hapa ruto na yeye ako hapa our pres- our faith president it's okay but watu waache kuongea mdomo mingi kuhusu baba siyo ya me- shindwe kwa nini unaongea vitu hata ujui enda kwanza Read about baba. Soma baba ametoka wapi? Amepigania inchi aje. Si kuropoko huku ije ukiongea maneno hata aieleweki ukitukana na huku. Eh? Baba is a father, is a husband. So the moment tunaongea maneno mbaya kumuhusu, that's nonsense. Eh? Na, na Kenyan people sahi wanafaa wa change, wa change mentality kuongea vitu mbaya kuhusu mtu hata huyo mtu hata mwezi patana hata siku moja mko very far eh lakini wewe ndio unaropoko huko ile ukimtusi sijuangi ni nini mbaya Kenya ndio wana, watu wanajua kutukana watu sana eh na makali yani na ukipata ule mtu anatukana na hata fuda party ya kukula ashibi na ndio anatoka huko nje amekopa data huko na na freezer anakuja kutukana na huko nje people think about your life wachana na politics kama uwezani na politics wachana nazo politics si zako ah ah 
politics leo utaona baba wametukanana na Raira na na, na na Ruto kesho uone Ruto wamesalimiana wame na baba amesanitaizwa nani atakuwa na aibu ni wewe ni wewe 2013 eh uhuru alikuwa anaita Raira kimodo eh saa hii ni mabe wewe kama ulikuwa hapo unatukanana pia nani ameshikwa na aibu ni wewe juu hapa hutumia akili boa wachana nazo Usituk, usitukane eh politician wachana na wao wacha watukanane huko sisi tuko huku nje kwa ground tunacheka lakini wewe usinue mdomo yako kuwatukana no eh usiende kutukana president huo ni mtu amechaguliwa na watu ati Ruto sijui amefanya nini ae wachana na ye is our fifth president na ime mpaka koti imesema hivyo that's okay baba na ye yuko tumuombe sasa hii apone askii poa eh na Mungu ampe maisha marefu tukue tukimuona we celebrate that hero is our hero ni mtu mheshimiwa sana hii hii nchi Kenya Hmm? So kuongelelea baba vibaya, kuongelelea Ruto vibaya, kuongelelea any minister vibaya, governor. It's nothing changing in your, uh, nothing change in their life. So j- jaribu kuongea maneno yenye inafaa. Si kutoka nje unatukanana kwa social media wewe una wewe wewe. Kesho baba yako atakuwa mheshimiwa, atukanwe pia. Utafila aje. Hmm? ama we Mungu akubariki usimame uchaguliwe watu waanze kukutukana wewe ni devil worshiper sijui wewe ni nini that's nonsense tunafaa tuwe machua very mature people watu waseme yeye enda bondo sijui nini na pia politician politician pia chagueni ma, maneno mnaongea nyinyi ndio mna insight people eh na mwingine sasa sasa hii amegeuka alikuwa anasema miti ikatwe yote ati kuna mtu atajinyonga venye uchaguzi litangazwa ame change statement amekuwa kama nini Ka, e, nini kamilio na ame change rangi <laughs> unasikia mpaka watu wanaongea politician wanafaa wakue wakichunga maneno yao ya mdomo juu wewe unaangaliwa na watu wengi sana in this world unaangaliwa na, na wakenya wote na kuna watu wanakupenda kuna watu wewe ni role model wao. So ukisema maneno mbaya pia watu watakufuata. Hmm? Mimi nakwambia ni grow up nikichukia baba because of community. Nikakuwa nika, nika mkubwa nikaanza kusoma. Who is this baba watu wanamchukia? Ni nini alifanya watu ndio wamchukie? Nikakuta nikakuta is a genuine man. Ni mtu amepigania nchi. Paka nikajiuliza Nikaambia Mungu anisamee. Ju nilikuwa namchukia bure. Sijui Kenya amefanya. Eh? Sasa ni celebrate him. Mimi niko mmoja wa kuselebrate baba. Hmm? Na kumuombea mafanikio na maisha marefu hii dunia. Unaona? Ju nimesoma nikajua si vile niliambiwa. Na ndio inasemekananga hata Biblia. Unaenda kanisa lakini tafuta Biblia jisomee because squeezy Kenya ina preachiwa na Kenya iko kwa Biblia it's a different thing watu wana preach Kenya wanataka kusikia lakini the word is different the word inaongelea mambo zingine eh waku have wisdom in life ulimi in James inasemanga ulimi ni kitu kanyama kadogo sana lakini kanaweza washa moto the whole country ichomeke juu ya hii ulimi maneno control your words eh ongea words mtoto wako ana, ana, atasikia afurahia aseme huyu ndio baba alikuwa anasema hivi ongea word tomorrow unaweza simama uongee you defend your words unaona be wise in life si kuongeanga maneno yani mpaka hey unajua hii hii hi, hi time ya politics what baka wabunge walikuwa naongea maneno zingine mpaka unataka kufunga masikio. Eh? Maneno uwezi watch na mzazi wako and it's a politician. Amwezi watch TV na mzazi. Eh? Eh? 
Ningepewa chance hata niongeleshe nini our politician leo ningewaambia wa control mdomo maneno si kuongea unasikia mbunge anasema tishoga sijui nini eh you see maneno mtu kama huyu anafaa kuongea you are a role model wa watu wengi so ukiongea maneno kama hayo the children they are listening to you kesho ndio watasema hivyo na wafanye hivyo venye unasema unaona ndio niliwaambia watoto wasikiangi venye unasema they follow your step eh masikio ya watoto ni macho wanaona venye unafanya ndio wanafanya kesho so do the right thing anyway much love and god bless you tuheshimu baba na tumuombe sasa ya askipo apone na mungu ampe maisha marefu hii dunia